Hey everyone, this is Patrice with the Positivity Corner and I'm back with another video and of course we're talking TV theme music and oh my goodness, mm -mm -mm. one of the most iconic animated sitcoms ever in the history of TV. Originally broadcast 1960 and so beloved by millions and millions of people all over planet Earth. Of course, I'm talking about the iconic The Flintstones. Yeah, yeah. You got Fred, his lovely wife, Wilma, his pet Dino, and remember, he had the cat, right, baby puss? Yeah, that was the one that was always throwing him out the door <laughs> and locking him out, right? And, of course, you know, Fred and his family, you know, Pebbles and Wilma. But his next door neighbor and BFF and co-worker, Mr. Barney Rubble with his gorgeous wife, Betty Rubble, and their son, Bam Bam. Ugh. Loved the Flintstones as a kid. Absolutely loved it. And it's still popular today with um, all ages. I love... The Flintstones, even now and then I'll, I'll catch an episode on TV. It's really subversive when you think about it because it's really a commentary on modern life during that time. And it's wild because they're acting like modern folks, right? They got like the modern sort of conveniences of life, but they're in the freaking stone age, right? So it doesn't make sense. Like like when they're driving and they're using their feet. <laughs> yeah, they got cars, but using their feet, right? It's just, it's just wild. It's just a wild show. And of course, Fred, who's just so inept on his job and in his life. He's a, just a fool, ain't he? <laughs> but, um, Funny as hell. It's still funny as hell. And I still get a chuckle every time I watch it. Fact. The Flintstones was loosely based on another classic sitcom. The Honeymooners. Fred Flintstone was based on two people. The guy who first voiced him, right? And that guy's name, I want to make sure I get it right, was Alan Reed. He was the guy who originally voiced Fred Flintstone. And Jackie Gleason. And you know what? When you listen to Fred, he sure as hell sounds like Jackie Gleason. And when he's going, well, Ma! Same deal, right? Genius. Absolute genius. Um, it was wildly popular when it came out. And let me tell you, that's an understatement. The Flintstones was the most financially successful and longest running network animated television series for 30 years. Until... Another beloved animated series passed it in 1997. That's for the younger generation, right? The Simpsons. And when a poll was done of the greatest cartoons of all time, The Simpsons came in at number one and The Flintstones came in at number two. I'm telling you, I love Fred and the gang. This TV uh, theme 
is really short. It's only it's less, less than a half a minute or a little bit more than a half a minute. Um, this is not the original one, though. The original one is different. And I listened to it. It's not as good. It's not as good. Um, starting in season three, they changed it to the familiar meat. The Flintstones. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. It's just, it's hilarious. And of course, if you know the opening credits, you know the whole scenario, you know Fred's going to work, whatever. It's time to get off work. He's going home. It's the whole nine yards. Everybody knows it by heart. Here you go. <laughs> From 1963, The There you go, short and sweet, but oh, so iconic. And of course, the end theme is eerily simil for, uh, similar, right? It's the same thing, except at one point, Baby Puss throws Fred out the house and he's banging on the door going, Wilma! That's the difference between the opening and the end. Yeah, really, really... <laughs> really iconic. Love it. As always, this is Patrice with the Positivity Corner. If you like what you just heard and saw, please click the like button. And uh, don't forget to share as well. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for further content. I'll be back with some more <laughs> TV themes. Take care, everyone.